Hello everyone, this is Sapphire Ocelot, and welcome to Hypixel Skyblock. Now, let me tell you, this wasn't my first choice for recording today. I actually had a bit of trouble today, because I originally had recorded Minecraft Hardcore, but um, for some reason I thought the world was lagging, but it was my recording lagging causing my voice to go all weird, meaning that it was messing up the recording itself. So, that was a problem. So we decided on just scrapping that all together because, I mean, it would have been a little annoying. There was, um, I don't know where I got these. There was some parts where it didn't lag at all, and it was good. But there were also parts that did lag. So it just made it kind of unbearable to listen to. Because it was kind of hard to understand what I was saying. Even though it was only for short seconds. But anyways, we're on Hypixel Skyblock now. And I just warped to an island so I can get to the deep caverns quickly. Because I need to get a little bit of experience. So I can put my sharpness 5 on my silver fang. And I don't like this no block thing. I forgot about that. So let's turn that off. Okay. That's what we want. Alright. So if we talk to him and go to the place, um, we can fight mobs that spawn in here. And this is Hypixel Skyblock, but it also is pretty far from it, giving you an opportunity to explore a Hypixel hub world as well in its own separate game, which is pretty cool because it allows you to... Why is that still playing? I have no idea. You know what? Whatever. I don't care. And of course that was a bit of lag. The server lagged itself. I don't think that's my recording lagging anymore. Hopefully not. But we just need... How much do we need exactly? I don't even know. Maybe we already have enough. Um, so for the Silver Fang to get Sharpness 5, we need 54 levels. That might take a bit of grinding. So, you know what time it is. It's grinding time. But I won't make you sit through that. Well... No, I won't, because I'm only at level 36. So, I'm going to do this on my own, of course. not sped up because I, I just want to do a little bit so I think what I'm also going to do is once this is done um, I'm no longer going to need my original diamond sword so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell it in the auction house because my silver fang is a lot more a, a lot more powerful than um, than the diamond sword because as you can tell, I two shot that skeleton, but now I pulled out the diamond sword, and once I find a mob, I will show that um, you missed. Uh, well, that was because of thorns, and I died, of course. 
um, but I usually get a three or sometimes four shot with the sword. So I think what I'm going to do is just get rid of the sword because I mean, it's good, but it could be a lot better. And then once we're done with the auction, I'm going to go take a look at the end because I have looked at it briefly but not uh, not a lot so I think it would be a good idea to go take a look at the end even though I'm probably going to die a lot and just see what that has to offer because it's pretty much brand new now it was just added in the last update I think less than a week ago now so I, I think it's good to just check the end. I kind of just ran a little bit around it. Didn't really look at it too much. But from what I saw, it looked pretty good. So we're at level 49. We need five levels more. So I'll talk to you guys then. Alright, we're one level away now from getting the level 54. And I just died again, so that's why I'm up here. Um... So we can get this pretty easily now, I think. And then I just would like to come back down here and see if I'm doing any more damage to mob. Because, I mean, I am one-shotting them, but sometimes I get the two-shot, like right there. Perfect explanation. But I feel like once I put the Sharpness 5 on, I should be able to one-shot them every time. Again, the skeleton seems stronger than the zombies, because the zombies seem to go down in one hit more frequently than the skeletons. Anyways, we're level 54, so let's go back to the island, and we will put this book on our silver fang, and we're still in combat. Still in combat. There we go. Now we're good. So, put the silver thing there. Uh, we also have that, which I'm probably going to put on a pickaxe because it's got efficiency. There we go. 54 levels. There we go. Well, perfect. Now, let's see how much this would be to put on a pickaxe, actually. Because I only have efficiency 1, and it would be nice to have more efficiency. Only 7 levels? We can go do that, and while we do that, let's... Go test out the Silver Fang. That's like nothing. And then we'll go check out the end and put up our auction. And now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure I have another auction that I put up. I don't remember if I already took it out, but if I haven't, now would be a good time to check it. Um, so we only need seven levels, not too hard. Sharpness 5 is now on here. Along with experience 3, so we're getting plenty of experience, and we have sharpness. So we should do just fine. I would assume I'm going to one-shot everything now, but don't quote me on that. And the extreme server lag, and I didn't one-shot it, of course. But I think that was because of thorns. So let's test on the skeleton, because that seems to be what doesn't die in one shot. Or I'll test it on you. You died. Uh, I need a skeleton, buddy. And we're level 10, so we're just fine. You're dead. This is a lot easier. You're dead. Okay, always. It doesn't always one shot, but with a few more enchantments... It should be just fine. I'm planning on putting Smite on because I come down here a lot. So I should be able to put Smite on there, no problem. And we're also helping the Nether Fortress with the Pigmen. So we're level 10 now. Um, let's head back to my island before something shoots at me and I go into combat because then I have to wait longer and let's run. Uh, Island. Yes. We made it. Okay. So, let's put, put that efficiency on the pickaxe. Uh, Thunderlord we don't really need because we're one-shotting anyways. There we go. So, it has efficiency 5 on it now. 
Um, there we go. Efficiency 5. I got my minions going, but I'll empty them later. Uh, head out to the hub. And this is the hub for those who haven't played High Pixel Skyblock. So they got a bunch of villagers just giving out information at the beginning of the game because this is quite customized. And let me just deposit my coins over in the bank. Or let's take some out actually for setting up an auction. So how much do we have? We have 26,400. So let's take out 20% of that. And we have 5,000. We definitely won't need that, but that'll be fine for now. So now we can go over to the auction house and put up this sword. Um, let's see, did I bid on anything? I don't think I have. Okay, I don't think so. So, um, let's see, do I have any? No, I do not. Okay. I don't have any auctions. Um, what is this? I don't know. Okay, I'll have to look into that. But... Alright, I don't have any. Create an auction. So... We're going to put in the sword. There we go. Uh, starting bid will be... Uh, let's see, 1,000. Just because it, uh, it did take time to put some stuff on it. No, not 40. Um, not 40. 1,000. 1,000. There we go. That should work. <sighs> Let's try a hundred. Can I do that? Because it doesn't seem... Mm. This is not going well. One thousand coins. Couldn't read that number. Well, this is stupid. So, 50. Let's see. Does that change it? Ah, <sighs> whatever. Duration. Uh, two days. That gives it time for you guys to come in and take a look at it. So, I'll put it up for two days. I don't mind paying the bid. And, um, create auction. And confirm. There we go. Now what I want to do before we move on, actually, is go over to this. And if you are on Hypixel Skyblock and you do want to bid on that, go take a look at it. Under my name, Sapphire Ocelot YT. Uh, let's reforge this with 500 coins. Um, odd. Let's see. Crit chance. Intelligence minus 10. Let's see. Strength plus 4. Hmm. Strength plus 2. Strength plus 2. No. Uh, epic. Yes, we'll go with that for now. Because I don't want to use all my coins. Uh, so we'll go back to the bank really quick. And then we'll go check out the end. Because I haven't really been there. And then I think we'll call it an episode. So let's go back over to the bank. And deposit. There we go. 22,447.4 coins. That's what I'm talking about. Alright. Um, so let's see if I can find my way. I always have trouble with this one. 
well, not with this particularly, but getting to the spider's den always seems to be troubling for me because you either end up in the spider's den or you end up in the forest. Oh, come on, you're nothing. Knock it off. Okay, I think I have to follow this path. And then this one, I believe? I don't know. These zombies are pretty fast, but I can outrun them. Yes, this looks about right. This guy's heading over here too, so... Yes, perfect. Okay. Hello, Minecraft cave noise train. Alright, over to the spider's den. Um, actually, before we go over there, over to there, I want to go check out the Nether Fortress very briefly, so I'll go do that and come back. Alright, in we go to the Blazing Fortress. I don't do this area, like, at all. I've only been here once, I believe. So, once this is loaded up, let's head inside. The Blazing Fortress. I don't know how well I'm going to do in here. There's supposed to be a Magma Cube boss that spawns every two hours, apparently, but I've never seen it. But maybe that's because I'm never in the Nether Fortress. Um, okay, you don't one-shot me anymore. Yay! And I actually killed you. Wow, that was surprising. Oh, right, but I'm withered. Oh, no. Oh, that didn't last long. Okay. Backing up. Backing up. What's over here? Let's look around. Um, I would guess this is where you fight giant magma cube. Yeah, this is definitely where you fight giant magma cube. Because it's so open like this, this is 100% where you fight them. And the Magma Cube killed me over the Wither Skeleton. Wow, that's surprising. I would think the Wither Skeleton would do more damage. But, alright. Let's head in one more time. See what's up at the top. Oh, and he did kill me. Wow, okay. I don't know how he didn't kill me the first time, but... Whatever. Let's see what's at the very top. Well, if I don't die. I think I'm gonna die. There we go. You're dead. Hurry before anything gets at me. If you just keep running, they can't catch you. So, I believe it's over here, and you're dead. And I'm withered, of course. Okay, there's just too many, and I was gonna do that anyway, so thank you, um, teleporter. Alright, time to go look at the end. So I got my sword up for auction. I went to the Blazing Fortress. The last thing we're going to do is check out the end. Before the end of this. So once that lag clears up, all we gotta do for this is... Jump down... Without dying. There we go, we didn't die. And the end portal... Well, the end teleporter thingy is just right over here pretty simple to get to once you get down. And I've got skeletons shooting at me. That's not good. Alright, over to the end. It looks like a giant spiked thing. But it's all mostly underground from what I understand. And that is a lot of lag. Alright, we... Let's see what's up here. The long flight of Mario 64 stairs. Oh, what's this? Uh, the end race. What is this? Um, what is this? Okay. Come talk to me over here, I'll tell you all about the end race. Um, I assume you get something good from that end race, so maybe I'll do that in the next episode, once I figure out what I gotta do there.
So let's look at this. Um, enchanted book and stone. Okay, so you can just buy stuff here. Uh, Ender Slayer. That's a lot of coins. Um, you're the one I have to talk to, but I'll come back to you later. Let's just go look at what we can find in here. Um, there's supposed to be a dragon's nest, but I'm not sure where to find that. And these endermen are very loud. Um, no, I don't need endermen after me. And of course, I die. Alright, we can take the long way, I guess. Looks like he's having fun. I wonder if we could even kill one. I want to test that now. Would you be quiet? You are so... You are so loud. Alright, there we go. Let's see if we can get him. Nope, apparently not. We need to become a lot stronger to get into here, I think. And you're still pretty loud. Or maybe, maybe, maybe. Come on. Come on. Yes! Got it. Why do I have a slow... Oh, right, because I killed a slime on the way up to the nether fort. First strike and smite. I forgot about that sword. And I died again. I didn't realize they all had 4,500 health. I thought that was a, a runic enderman, but I guess not. The runes are also new to this right now. And let's see how fast I mine obsidian. Pretty quick. I mean, it's a lot quicker than it used to be. Is this the way down to the dragon's nest? I don't know. Did I die? Yeah, I died. <laughs> that enderman was mad. Well, I mean, if I spam click, I can kill him. Why I like the 1.8 combat over everything else, because you can just spam click, and they're back! Thank you for killing him. Four ender pearls. Run, run, run. I have endermen after me. Grab that EXP. I run down here. I'm level 22. Awesome. Level 23. I like it. No, don't look at them. And I looked. Alright, I think this is going to conclude this episode of Hypixel Skyblock. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do more episodes on here. That's up to you guys if you want to see more of this on my channel. And hopefully I can record a Minecraft Hardcore next. So if you do want to see a Minecraft Hardcore, hit the like button so I know. Because I tried to record it and it didn't work. So, that's going to conclude this episode. Please comment and tell me what I should do next, because I'm honestly not completely sure. And I will probably do a bit of remodeling before a next episode. That's if I do one. I'm not completely sure. But, I will be back very soon with the next video. Hopefully either Minecraft Hardcore, or we'll jump into another episode of Sky Factory. Comment down below and let me know what you want to see. So that concludes everything I have to say. So from all of us at Hypixel, see you all later. Goodbye. <laughs>